On every planet in the galaxy, you'll find the Flux, a powerful, magical energy. Here on Achillean, we call it the Breath. Flux is so strong that it had to be banned, except in galactic football, the most spectacular sport in the universe. But 15 years ago, a mysterious explosion rocked Achillean, swept the breath away, and destroyed our chances in the Galactic Football Cup. 15 years without a decent team, and nothing but snow and ice. Now, hope lives again. Young, new players to revive the breath of Achillean. Our fate is in their hands. Galactic Football. Last time on Galactic Football. We're going to match him to a ball. Soon they'll be playing their first round-robin match against the Rikers. May, you'll be on defense with Thran, and that's my final decision. You're in love, man. In love? Are you nuts? The Rikers are using their metal yell. Ahito, wake up. <laughs> Rocket. Is it true that you're Mr. Archer's nephew? Why didn't he tell us? Whoa, Ahito's escaping. He's bolting out. What did you think? That you were going to get presents? Come on, you gotta hang in there. It's not over yet. Just because you're Archer's nephew doesn't mean you have to give us lessons. Please, Tia, leave me alone. Rocket isn't here. Arcadia News. News that spans the galaxy. Greetings, everyone. Coming right up, our galaxy's weather report. And it'll be sunny and warm in the Silo Archipelago all day long. But of course, it's always warm and sunny on Silo. Which, if you think about it, is a bit on the annoying side. Oh. On Nabok, however, watch out for a meteor shower at the end of the afternoon. Those Nabokians always know how to have a good time. But the highlight of the day is the ice storm heading for Achillean, a storm of magnitude 18 on the Gombervit scale. Oh, dear Achillean friends, if I were you, I'd stay at home and watch me, Nork Agnet, all day long on Arcadia News. Coming up, an intergalactic traffic report. But first, a quick word from our sponsor. When I catch a pirate, I like to look impeccable. That's why I use nickel chrome. Ooh, you capture my reflection. Thanks, nickel chrome. Attention, not for use on organic creatures. We remind you that the price on Pirate Leader's Sunny Backbone's hat is now at 2 million standard credits. For a more beautiful galaxy, help Technoid. More modern than boxes and newspapers, but definitely not as much fun. You remember? We always fought so Papa would let us protect the greenhouses during storms. What do you want? Rocket's missing. What? I thought he must have come here, but it looks like I was wrong. You mean to tell me that I entrust my son to you and you're unable to take care of him? Norada, you know that Rocket's a complicated kid. He wasn't complicated before you showed up and put all sorts of wacko ideas in his head. He already had those ideas in his head. How do you plan on finding him? He'll come back. It's just a matter of days. You came back when you ran away from home. Huh? Arch! Keep me posted, okay? Of course.
Wow! Awesome! Big deal! I could do the same thing if I had the breath. But you do have it, Thran. You heard, Arch. The breath is in you. In me? Yeah, well, it's pretty well hidden. Hey, anybody in there? Maybe you could bait it with some cheese. Or maybe sing it a love song. You know, one of those tunes that makes anyone melt? Well, almost anyone. Well, until it makes up its mind, I'm getting back to work. Clam, can you send me the ball even higher this time, please? No problem, Jock. And now he's got to show off. As soon as I come back down, I'll buy you a drink at Planet Achillian, okay? Uh, you want to bet he forgets? I don't get it. Everything seems to be fine. Believe me, what we felt was not fine at all. Right, Tia? I'm going to prepare a potion to boost your energy. That's all I can do for now. You resent me for Rocket, right? Hold on, Tia. You can't just blame us because he split town. You and everybody else never accepted him as the captain, and even less as a friend, and without even knowing that Arch is his uncle. So, it seems we had a few injuries. Nothing serious, Arch. I don't think so, anyway. But I'm going to fix everything in a jiffy. Sir? Any news from Rocket? No, I went to see his father. But he wasn't there. And none of you have any idea where he could be hiding? No, sir. How about you, Tia? No, sir. No idea. Well, anyway, he'll be back. I'm sure of it. He loves football too much to give it up. At least I hope so. It's not over yet. Everything will come back to you over time. You think we're nearing the solution, Isan? Yes, I think so. But I'm not so sure that's good news. <sighs> hey, Clamp, it's me. Huh? Clamp? You okay? <sighs> Boy, dude, you're looking grim. Look what I brought you, Lothar Racer, the latest spaceship racing game. Wait till you see it, dude. It rocks. I don't have time to play, Fran. Really? What are you working on? A new training contraption? Can I see? Don't touch that. And leave me alone, all right? OK, OK. Calm down. <sighs> I'm out of here. Gee, you're so edgy these days. Oh, 
glad I found you, Simbai. Do you have anything to calm the nerves? Uh, not for me. It's for Clamp. He's so weird. Clamp? Yeah. I don't know what's wrong with him these days. He explodes any time you get near him. And I mean like a supernova. Can you believe it? Loon Zara just turned 20, and she's already written her memoirs. Where are you going? Outside? No, I'm just going to the lounge. With your coat? I'm cold. You're cold? Here? You ought to record this conversation, May. Really? It's so fascinating. It could fill an entire chapter in your memoirs. <sighs> Whatever, it's your life, right? If I win this hand, I'm inviting May out to dinner. If you win the next ten hands, she might accept. Contrary to what you think, Jock, May is subject to my charm. It's a girl thing. She just acts like she doesn't care. Wow, she's a really great actress then, because it really looks like she could care less about you. What are you two doing? The Shadows Pirates match is about to begin. Well, I'm going. We'll meet there. What are you doing, Tia? The match is this way. I'm coming. I just want to get some air first. Get some air? In this weather? She must be sick. Or be up to something. Come on. Hey, what about the match? I said come on. It is, huh? I don't know what you're talking about. Tia? Yeah, I might have an idea. A precise idea? Rocket fixed up a cave near the Sharkle building. I think he might be... We're coming with you. What? Did you see what it's like outside? Microwise, Rocket left because of us. So it's up to us to bring him back. match on more than one account is underway. A match that will allow us to judge the level of the Snow Kid's future adversaries, the Shadows and the Pirates. A match that will also see Sinead suit up for the first time in a Shadows uniform. And here he is with the ball! And finally, as with every Pirates match, the big question remains. How will the Pirates escape the Technoid Police at the end of the match? I'll just remind you that the Pirates benefit from League immunity on the field and in the dressing rooms. But once outside, there's still a price on their heads. And there you have it, dear viewers. Everything you need for an exciting match. Clamp isn't coming? No, he's working. That's strange. He never misses a match. That brings back some memories, huh, Arch? And we're back at the Shadows Field for the second half of today's match between the Shadows and the Cyclopses. As you can see, the score is tied nil-nil, but... Oh! Arch attacks right from the start with a surprising break! Looks like he's decided to take things into his own hands! The Cyclops defense has sensed the danger, so they're trying to cut Arch off as he winds up for the kick, but... Oh, yes! Arch scatters them without even breaking a sweat! He's one determined player! has become a ball-catching machine! And the other team is eating his dust! But wait! What's happening? It seems that Arch has lost his energy all of a sudden! 
Stop. What are you talking about? We never played so well before. We're gonna become the greatest players ever. I don't care. Not at this price. <laughs> don't let me down, Arch. Don't let me down, Arch. Don't let me down. Don't let me down. Don't let me down. Well, I'd hate to be outside in this weather. You all right, Arch? I'll be fine, Dame Simba. I'll be fine. I told you this was a bad idea. Not only are we not gonna find Rocket, but as a bonus, we're gonna get buried under three tons of snow. We have to find shelter. Drink this. It'll warm you up. It doesn't look like anything I've ever seen, but your machine sure does go fast. I built it myself. No way! I would have never guessed. That what? That I like to build things? That I like to go fast? Or that I know how to have fun? You have to admit that you kept it pretty secret. You have to admit that you never asked. Okay, Rocket, we admit it. We weren't always very cool with you. Right, Jock? Right, Jock? Yes. Rocket, Microice and Jock came with me to ask you to come back. We need you. That's right. A team without a captain is like a girl without a smile. It loses all its charm. That's nice, but I don't know. The match is in full swing, and the Shadows have complete control of the ball. The ball is heading for Sinead, alone against the defense. Oh my gosh! Sinead is having his first experience with the smog. The shadows flux right in front of our eyes. He's going to shoot! Yeah! 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 Oh! Six to one! The shadows crush the pirates! Only 20 seconds left. Incredible! What kind of invention have the pirates got their hands on this time? Players who become invisible at the end of a match? Now that's the first!
Did you see that? They lost, but they're stars, no matter how you slice it. I just love the pirates. Hey, we are Jock and Micro Ice. Uh, were you sleeping or what? They went here for the entire match. Micro Ice and Jock, we looked for them everywhere. They vanished. It's here too. What? You wouldn't happen to be looking for us, would you? You were outside in this weather? The three of you are completely out of your minds. Do you realize that you could have died out there? And I'm responsible for you. You should have let me know. Your attitude is completely irresponsible. It's my fault. They came looking for me. Rocket, you're finally here. You took all that risk just to find him? That's no reason. You just don't go and do such foolish things, especially when you're part of a team. You have to be responsible for yourself, but also for everyone else. Arch, I think they got the point. What matters is they are all safe and sound. All right, everyone get suited up and meet at the holo training in two minutes. But, sir, it's almost night. Did you say something, Micro Ice? No, sir. No. That's what I thought. All right, get moving. You have to admit that they've got guts. You'll see, Rocket. We got even better since you left. Especially me. Think we're nearing the solution, Isan? Yes, I think so. But I'm not so sure that's good news. Sunny Blackbones? Next time on Galactic Football. You have to find a way to be an attacker. I know, Mom, but what can I do? Oh, gee. We're never going to score. You sure you're all right, Clamp? You don't seem well these days. Clamp's attitude seems to have changed. I wouldn't be surprised if he was hiding something from us. Come on in. I was just talking with Jack. What? In Jackie Chan Adventures, Jade accidentally creates enough versions of herself to enter a team in the World Cup. Imagine facing a team of Jades. Oh, terrifying.